guys. So I had this idea of a a vlog that I wanted to do and I wanted to do this in spring, then summer, and I kept talking myself out of it. And so I'm finally going to do it. And um, it's basically how I prepare for fall. How do I build my fall wardrobe? Um, I never want to feel like I don't have anything to wear in my closet because I have quite a lot of clothes and it's ridiculous for me to just be like I don't have anything to wear and so I want to recycle and reuse clothes so um, I'm just going to show you guys really quick how I go about building up a new wardrobe for a new season and gearing up for it so the first thing that I do is I look to see what are the colors for the season going to be and in general the colors are pretty much the same every year they might vary by a few shades maybe a little lighter lighter or a little bit darker but in general the colors are usually the same and then once I find out what the colors are that's when I start building my wardrobe so the first thing that I do is I go through my closet and I just start pulling clothes and if you've seen on my main channel how I organize my closet is organized by the color wheel so that makes it really easy for me to just go through see what colors I want and just start pulling stuff so last night I did just that and it's actually really funny because I pulled so much stuff that actually broke my rolling rack so I didn't I anyway I didn't know I was gonna pull that much stuff but um so I just want to show you a few items that I have all of this stuff is old I don't have any new items up here that I'm gonna show you guys this is basically how I start out building my new wardrobe bringing in a little bit old then you're gonna supplement with a few new items so the first thing is first is you want to pick items that are I would say timeless so for me I feel like red and blue are always going to be great colors to wear um, regardless of the season this nice pretty red color is great and the material is great now I live in Florida so obviously I'm not going to be wearing you know heavy coats and sweaters like this is something that I can wear almost year-round so I pulled that because I love the color, I love the detail and the gold buttons. But the great thing about this is that nautical fashion is always in style. And this reminds me of something very nautical. Then you have a top like this. This is a peplum top. Peplums are still in style. This color, this nice very pretty crimson red color is definitely going to be hot for fall. But you can also wear it in winter. And with this embellishment around the neck, to me that screams the holidays so this would be something that I may even keep up here when I do the same thing for fall so some other items that I have that I love for fall would be this kimono animal print animal print and jewel tone color blocking is one of my favorite things to do during the fall and so I definitely wanted to pull this Last fall, I actually styled this with um, a burgundy or oxblood type color, but there's so many things that you can do with something like this. So I definitely wanted to pull that. And then I also pulled these floral pants. These floral pants are MNG collection for Target. And during the fall, you're going to see a lot of dark floral colors. Um, muted out and this one has really great colors for fall because you have the black you have the mustard and the orange and basically all the colors that are going to be hot for fall so these pants are great to have in your arsenal um, this item right here I love the skirt I got this from H&M probably three years ago and they bring the skirt back every year when fall comes around it's in their catalog it's in their stores and it has this really great plaid print and this skirt you can dress it up like if you're going to work or you can just dress it down and do it kind of chic but it's a really basic skirt and it's got this this plaid print and every fall 
they do have a lot of items like this in their store. I picked these up last year and these are almost like a wool short. I only got to wear these shorts one time last year. So they're definitely something that um, you can wear over and over and over again. And this skirt is a great example of that because I've worn this skirt so many times. Okay, so some other items that I did pull. I pulled a bunch of neutral blouses. Not so much as a bunch of like white blouses, but this one is kind of like a cream with gold. This is a white blouse. This is another white blouse and this is a nude blouse. These are all basics that you want to have readily available for when you're styling outfits so that you know what your options are. Same thing with browns, grays, and black shell shirts. You want to have those readily available. So um, lastly, some, some other items that I definitely wanted to bring down here or actually bring up here. Like I said, it's not going to get cold anytime soon, but we may have a few days where there's a cold front coming through and I might want to put on a cute coat. So I brought this coat down. Black and white trends are always in style. One thing I've noticed is that all through fall and winter, mint stays in style. They might call it something other than mint, you know, when the season changes, but usually mint is still in style. So I definitely want to have a few of those items, a few pastels. Um, sometimes you can find quite a few really lovely pastels during fall, um, such as like a light lavender or a light pink. Um, other than that, there's a few other obvious choices that I picked out for fall, which is like burnt orange. And of course chartreuse this is one of my favorite colors so some of these items actually a lot of these items i haven't really had a lot of chances to wear them just because i don't go out a lot but um yeah you basically never want to feel like you need to just buy a whole new wardrobe just because the season changed you want to find stuff that you know it's still in style, still in good shape, and you can pair it with something else, maybe a new pair of shoes or a new necklace, change it into a whole other outfit. And that is something that I love to do on my main station. So anyway guys, um, hope you enjoyed this quick little video. If you liked it, then I'll do it again for winter because I always do this and I love to share great information. So I'll talk to you guys later.